What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Just M. Today I wanted to share with you guys a few spring outfits that I've put together featuring some of the key spring pieces that I've started to collect in my wardrobe. Make sure to like and subscribe if you like this kind of content and let's go ahead and get started. So first up is a super basic outfit, but I think is very versatile for the springtime. Uh, it's a long maxi skirt, a cargo maxi skirt that's white with black long sleeve. And here I'm pairing it a little bit dressy. I'm adding some heeled uh, kitten mules as well as my shoulder bag. And I think this alone is actually a super cute outfit. I think this is great for if you are running errands, if you just want to look a little bit more put together with the meals, but obviously you can substitute with a sneaker for a little bit more of a dress down look. And here I'm adding a jean jacket on top if where you are is still a little bit chilly. Having a jean jacket definitely makes it a lot more casual, but um, you can also dress it up with a blazer, for example, if you want a more formal look. Going along with the theme of skirts, next up, I'm using a mini skirt as my base, the same top, and I am adding some knee-high boots that I actually really love that I got from Vagabond recently. And then pairing that with a sleek black shoulder bag, I think works really well with the boots as more of a, you know, going out or a nighttime type of look. And then keeping on theme here, adding in a leather blazer to tie everything together. I really like how this turned out. It's very simple. It's kind of just colors of gray and black but definitely a good go-to if you can't really think of what to wear but still keeping you know fairly cool and casual um, going out on the town Next up, we have a little bit more of a preppy look, I wanna say. So I wanted to experiment a little bit with these leg warmers that I just got recently. I was super inspired by Jenny from Blackpink um, and her concert outfits. If you guys know, you know, they're super cute. I wanted to recreate that in a more everyday casual setting. And so how I paired this was with a little cropped trench coat jacket. I love these types of jackets when it comes springtime because you don't have, you know, all of the warmth and bulk, but you still get the effect of layers. So next up, I wanted to find something that is a little bit more dressy. Say if you are going to a date night or if you are, you know, going to work, maybe if your workplace is a little bit more casual, but this is what I would wear, keeping the same kind of pleated top that I have going on, just adding a white loose crop jean. I think it's perfect for spring. And I wanted to add in a long trench coat option for those that are, you know, still in the colder weather. So I thought this was a super sophisticated, simple look if you are just out and about. This next look here is an all white look. I wanted to find something that was appropriate if I was maybe going to a farmer's market, going thrifting, and I wanted something super casual, easy breezy, and so paired this with my jean jacket and a leather loafer to dress it up a little bit, and I had to get my leather crossbody to keep myself hands-free, especially if you are walking out and about doing some shopping. Um, so yeah, this is what I would typically wear as a very casual spring outfit that is still a little bit more put together. Next up, I'm ashamed to say that I've already worn this out, but I just love it so much that I wanted to recreate it here. This is just a very simple kind of 
parachute pant look. I thought it was a really cute juxtaposition between the kind of utilitarian nature of the parachute pants with a more baby doll floral eyelet top. So I thought this was just super easy and no fuss needed. I felt super comfortable in it and obviously very functional. Next up, I wanted to also utilize the same cargo pant but go a little bit more edgy. So channeling my inner Kim Possible here, it's just so reminiscent of that look but I added my crop trench to give it a little bit of layers and I felt like the neutrals in the pants and the jacket really tied in well together in this overall sort of earthy color palette. This look is definitely inspired by a little bit of the hip hop culture, so I can definitely see this being a great look out and about in the city, going shopping, um, going to the parks, etc. This next look here is what I would wear to more dressy events, like maybe going to a show, going to the ballet, for example. So I have this really cute midi pleated skirt that I wanted to style. And so I added that with my black tube top with a trench coat to elevate the look. And I thought this came along really nicely. If you know me, you know that I like pairing looks together that are a little bit more around the same color palette or monochromatic looks, so I felt like this one worked really well for that. This next look is again taking it a little bit more casual. I wanted to wear my dad jacket here. This has been a go-to jacket for me this spring that with my Jordans and a crossbody bag. Um, this is honestly what I look like day to day if I don't have much going on. So very simple, you know, jeans and a t-shirt, but always a classic. This next look, taking it back to the cargo skirt, I wanted to pair that a little bit more casually with the t-shirt. So you know, nothing super crazy, but I felt like just a really simple t-shirt with some sneakers just looked really cute with this and I felt super comfortable as well. I feel like you could walk a lot, you could eat a lot in this, so I felt like this is just a very easy go-to look for me and I will definitely be wearing this a lot more this spring. This next look, I really wanted to style this lace cami that I thrift it recently so I paired that with the mini skirt for a more feminine vibe and then I ended up putting on this crop jacket and just ended up really liking how it looks buttoned up so wanted to show that first. I thought this was giving a very equestrian vibes with the boots and the collar and I feel like this is really cute if you're just going out for brunch for example even if you want to go shopping like I think this would be something I would go to. And here I'm just unbuttoning the jacket to show the camisole underneath, which I thought was also a little bit more feminine and balanced out the look nicely. This last look, I wanted to pair this tank top a little bit more casually, so jeans and my crop trench coat is the way to go. This look is definitely inspired a little bit by Sex and the City 90s uh, New York City type aesthetic. I can just picture myself going to the corner bodega and picking out some flowers, like this is just the type of aesthetic that this outfit reminds me of, so very specific, but a vision is a vision. Let me know what you guys thought of the outfits so far and if there were any outfits that you'd be recreating for spring. I would love to hear from you guys from the comments below and until next time, bye!